When I say just go, it's just go. Right? That's all I know. All I know is go. Check. Uh. Started off like the theme song of power. Connect hit my phone, I have them gone in an hour. A nigga still dripping, I ain't dry for my shower. I know some real niggas that done died cause of cowards. It's the return of the nigga that never left. Fiends wanted to get right, I was cooking it with the left. Niggas only check the score to see if I done lost. Cause I'm breezing in a Porsche, color sweet and sour sauce. Tell them keep the cameras rolling just to capture the moment. See, I rap up. About cars, but actually own them. Ask for atonement. Tell them that I'm back and I'm focused. My name speaks for itself. I ain't lacking promotion. Haven't you noticed? I run with killers clapping them toasters. We done turn boogeymen into actual ghosts. Y'all did I mean? Homie, I am out of your league. I move that work across the border like Yassi Al Quig. Look. I'm honestly probably an anomaly That cut foes' faces I left niggas with apostrophes I came from the block So how could it be That I own two houses And bout to be three Niggas wanna rob who? Better palm they heaters Cause I stay around nines Like fourth grade teachers I'm a captain in my hood How can soldier niggas see me When it's time to go to war It's in my mode to keep a D.E. You missed that line My M.O. is D.E. I switch flows, the six volt is Kiwi I'm beefing with Charles, I'm squeezing it off My whole fit fresh, like I spent a week at the mall uh, I let weapons blast Shit, I keep squeezing on the pump like I'm trying to get extra gas So I suggest you don't swerve in my lane It's gonna cost six figures to throw dirt on my name See, I'm the man to these hoes, to these haters, I'm cocky Ten coupe, green seats, that's potatoes and broccoli They call me Martin in my hood, cause I stay with a Tommy When them checks came through, we would wait in the lobby Niggas murder for a name where I'm from, that's bragging rights Over green, you'll see red, that's traffic lights Lights, Cause over the green you see red on traffic lights There was no running in the hood where I'm from You had to fight, right?
I got my boy. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Hey. And I got one of the most dynamic two on twos. Uptown's finest. New York City's in the building. Mount Vernon's in the building. We are all here today with the lovely Shuneru. Hey. Hello. Hey. Hello, Queen. So we live from Chrome 23 and we got these lovely ladies here. Talk to us about the card. You know, first battle of the night is probably going to be. First off, let's get our hashtag popping, all right? Chrome 23, hashtag Chrome 23. We want to hear from you, all right? And who knows, you might see a tweet on the screen. Keep them hashtags going. You hear that's, me? that's right. We want to know 
I want to know who not wearing the right fit. I need that hashtag Chrome 23. I want to know who getting smoked tonight. I want to see caskets and bodies tonight with the Chrome 23 hashtag. You already know. Yes, you make know, sure we are t trending. Yeah, we'll we make to be sure, trending. make sure. And, and the thing is, we're finally here. Easy versus Geechee Gotti tonight. You got uh, you got Charlie Clips versus A Ward. That's a good one. You got one. Rosenberg Raw versus Shayna Ashley. And you got none other than First Lady Flames versus C3. It's a lot yes. of dopeness yeah, going on. That's a lady. Woo -woo. That's a yes. And although this is only four battles on the card, this is a heavy, heavy card right now. From beginning to end. Isn't it? From beginning to end. I'm going to keep it real with you. I still want to see somebody die tonight. I don't care what happens. <laughs> I don't care if it's a lady. I don't care if it's a man. Somebody going to die tonight. No the no. streets need a body, ladies. The streets, the streets need a body. Need a body. What about the face-offs? You see any of the face-offs last night? I ain't going to lie. It was a little too friendly for me. Geechee and Easy, they look like uh, the, in that uh, episode, uh, in that, um, that scene in Heat, when they was like, you do your thing and I do no, my they thing. They got we a little spicy. Yeah, they, nah. got a little, they did they have look, some funny somebody stuff, need but to they get got stabbed. a little spicy. I think, if anything, if we're talking about comedy and friendliness, I think C3 and Flames were way too friendly. Ladies, I wanted to see somebody get their hair pulled, get Ram. punched in the yeah, punched in the something. Not they punched were, in the face. Well, maybe not punched in the face, but shake the table, something. I mean, but both of them is kind of barbarians. They big on bars, so I it's know, like, we ain't got to do this back and forth. Let's get to these bars. I but I do, I do feel like that was just like the quiet to the storm. Before I feel like it's going right? to get really crazy yeah. in here. They both got high energy sometimes, but I feel like it's going to be a dope battle. I agree. So for the lovely Farrah Funeral, what's the battle you're looking forward to the most tonight? The battle I'm looking most forward to tonight, I would have to say it's Rosenberg and Shayna. That's a goodie. That's Shuni. why. Oh, I just feel like. They both have a lot to say to each other. I don't know why, but I feel like Rosenberg is like really disrespectful towards females, and, and Shayna is one of them ones. She's one of them ones. That's a fact. So That's he, fan. I feel like, don't play with her. She a female, but don't play with her. <laughs> All right, Shuni, I know y'all a team, right. so you can't take her pick. What battle are you looking forward to the most? Honestly, I am looking forward to the ladies. Being that both of their last battles was caution on tw um, Chrome 23, I want to see what they do with each other. You know what I mean? Like, I'm really looking forward to seeing what C3 does. She hasn't been back since she won the tournament. And then Flames did so well, they brought her right back. You know what I mean? So I'm really looking forward to who does that, who gets in there and just goes crazy. So that's one of the battles I'm looking forward to tonight. Who are you looking forward to, SP? I'm going to keep it real with you. I need Philly to hold that flag high. I need that, I need that sign. You know what I'm saying? It's a little bit of bias in this building. We need all that talk to stop. I want to see. You know what I'm saying? It's Philadelphia all day. It's the game. You already know what it is. Easy to block the verse Geechee Gotti. I need to see some blood. That's what I need to see. Well, are you going to tell us who you got? Or huh? Who you what? got? What? What? Oh, okay. No, no, no. No, okay. no. Oh, no, you okay. don't care. The streets needed a body. Huh? The streets need a body. I'm they saying do. somebody okay. wanted to die. It ain't going to be either one the of them. The streets need an answer. I like, I like both answer. competitors. But what I'm saying is, man, I'm going with easy to block, Captain. It's Philly Ooh, all day. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Early, making his early prediction. I'm sorry, Geechee. Please don't run up on me later. I'm just saying. Just, yeah. <laughs> you know you got people in the building. So right. who you got, Vada? Don't try to get out of it. Uh, this is a tough one. I'm going with easy with a slick 2-1. But that ain't tell us what battle yeah. you oh. most. Yeah. Oh, which battle I want to see the most? Right. Give me Charlie Clips versus A Ward because they battled in a one round battle before, and I had A Ward winning that one pretty clear. Let's see if Charlie Clips is going freestyle, wild out, or really show up with three rounds of written material. Mm, I like the way you put that. Do you that. think the freestyles are going to hurt him tonight if Charlie Clips comes up here with all freestyles? What do you think his strategy should be tonight? He might want to write material, counter write A Ward, but if you come in here and just freestyle all three rounds, A Ward's going to have another notch under his belt. Okay. I'm going to be real with you. In that second round, just expect all freestyle. I don't care. I, it's a what? rebuttal for everybody. I want to hear some rebuttal in the second round. Maybe the first round they could take off, but that second round, I want to hear somebody get rebuttal down to the ground. But you know what? I feel like this is going to be like really cool because Clips freestyles. And so does A Ward. Yeah. And, but I feel like A Ward's freestyles are like super intricate. Like he'll catch you in the middle of your round and just pull it, pull it apart. And yes. then he's gonna come like rapid fire. I, I can't wait for it. I, I feel excited. like it's gonna be a good one. As someone who's battled Charlie Clips before, how do you prepare? Mm. I'm here. It's time. I'm not even gonna lie to you. <laughs> she never battled that man. <laughs> I don't know what huh? they're talking about. I don't know what they're talking about. You was there. I was not there. <laughs> but you was there. That, that was there. Yeah. Oh, my bad. I'm okay. saying, yeah, okay. I was, okay. that was like, Not, what do they call those things? The, um, that, that was hologram. That was a hologram. Mm -hmm. I was sitting on Drake's couch that 
that, that. Technology is amazing no. these days. Okay. It wasn't me. Shaggy. John John, John John didn't come out of nowhere and said, I like, thought. Who's that? Uh, okay, yeah. Well, okay, let's like, be that real. Is. As somebody that battled Charlie Clutch, mm -hmm. all right. What do you think A Ward's strategy should be? Um, I feel like. Well, me and A Ward are two different people. That's I went okay. into the battle wanting to have fun. Like me and Clips, we have like a natural friendship. We laugh, we joke, we text each other and crack on each other all day. So I knew this battle wasn't gonna be serious. So I just went into it ready to have fun. And even though I think he took me more serious than any other girl he ever battled, yeah. he yeah. killed. Why would he come with three rounds like that? And then he tried to he tried to finesse me and have people. It didn't happen out. though. But crazy. it didn't happen though. See, yeah. it didn't happen. Yeah. Okay, so I mean, to you, know. you battled I, on Chrome 23 before I you did, did really well. Yeah. Uh, I was talking to you earlier I think I about. I did better, but thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> I was so talking you to you I. earlier about some of your last performances. You battled Shotgun Shook. That yeah. was a crazy one. Mm -hmm. When are we gonna see you again? And I'm gonna be honest. I heard Coffee calling you out. Ooh. Um, you know, I heard her calling me out as well. I also heard that I answered that call. So you, you guys picked might up. See that very, I did. Dong. When they called me, I did pick up. So you guys are gonna see okay. that. Very soon. Mount Vernon, don't 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 duck no smoke. Don't no smoke. So all you bitches that say my name, line them up. I'm gonna knock them down. You Roll them up and put them in a pack. I'm gonna knock them down. Can we hashtag Chrome 23? Hashtag. Knock them down. That's hashtag right. knock them down. Chrome hashtag 23. Knock them down. Streets um, need a body. All right. So you know, but last time I was here, obviously I said I felt like I could have done better. But it's a tough crowd sometimes, you know. And then as everybody knows, they kind of switched the order on us at the last minute. And I was talking about this before. But you only get your adrenaline rush once as a battle rapper. When they mic you up, that's when everything hits you. Like, yeah, I'm about to go on. And then as soon as they took that mic off, it was like they burst my balloon and I went down to the ground. And it was hard to kind of get it and pick it back up. So hopefully everybody tonight is able to keep that rush, keep that excitement, you know, stay ready. Because you never know what's going to happen. They could switch the order on them tonight. And that does hurt as a battle rapper. And if you stay ready, you ain't got to get You ready. understand me? Okay. Hey. Speaking of staying ready, Farrah, when are we going to see you back? You know, it's been a long time. We want to see you again, too, Wow, now. you know, um, <laughs> she's open for opportunities. Calendar <laughs> will be open shortly. Okay, <laughs> now, I'm just playing. I'm not ducking no smoke. I'm here for whatever. I took a break. You know, life has been life in. I have a whole career, but, you know, I'm here. I'm loving battle rap and the essence and bringing it back and you know what I'm saying battle rap has been on a roll it lately. has it has and I'm loving the energy so are you I'm, guys excited I'm ready to come back battle rap again like I feel like the feeling is back do you guys agree? I'm very much excited for battle rap this is this is my time for battle rap summertime is usually when it's all of the big events we done had a lot of good events really? I had a lot of great classic battles but for me, it feels like the battle of the year is set for tonight. Like, this is the most yes. anticipated battle I for tonight. I don't think there is any battles tonight that are battle of the year contenders if done right tonight. I mean, we got to start with Easy to Block Captain versus Geechee Gotti. You know, Remy Ma had Easy to Block Captain versus Hitman Holla. Phenomenal battle. Arguably a top three battle of the Definitely year. Definitely a battle of the year Gichi candidate. Gichi who's been on a run like he's been on and put him in front of Easy to Block Captain who's been on a run like he's been on. All the rumors, Agreed. all the all the stories, everything leads to this moment tonight. Now, if this battle could, turns out a classic, it's great for battle rap. But if somebody gets smoked, the timeline will never be the same. We need a what? What we need? Streets need a body. Streets need a body. Streets need a body. I want to see how the algorithm going. Algorithm, if the algorithm don't go the way that the algorithm thought it was going to go. Me? But I'm going down with the ship. You feel me? I'm saying I got to go down with the ship. I'm going to keep I it real with you. I got a question for you guys. Do you feel like, we're, we're obviously we know that this is one of the bigger battles on the card, right? Easy and Geechee. Do we feel like this is a stock drop battle for either one of them? If somebody comes in here and gets smoked, I mean like body on a pavement, right? Smoked in a pack. What do we do? Roll him up. Roll him up. What do we do? I think it's a it's a little bit of a double edged sword because right. if the battle's just good, then we gonna put it in a classic bin. Nothing really happens to either one of them too. Right. Even if either one of them have a crazy round that's like a a, a, a career-ending round, as long as the other one has another good career-ending round, it can be a stalemate. But if you get body tonight, if you get smoked tonight, I want to see them same Twitter fingers tomorrow morning. Oh, you want the same energy? I need that same energy. Okay? Hashtag keep so that now, energy, I have huh? a question, right? <laughs> so you said if they both do good, we just put it in a classic bin. 
are we putting it in a classic bin because that's where it's going to be long, or are we just putting it in there because of the two people that that? Like, oh, that was all right. Yeah, like yeah. Can we, we just give it an all right? If it's all right, can we be honest? Now it wasn't what we thought it was gonna be. It's it's all depends on how you want to view the battle. It's two times you watch it. When you watch it live, you got a little bit higher energy. Uh -huh. Replay value is then what makes that battle classic. If I got a two one either way in the building and two one either way on the camera. 2-1 either way down the street, down the line we two years from now. We know what we doing tonight, SP. That's politics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. what I was saying. Like, if somebody tonight. lose tonight, especially if they got this color on, listen, they're going upstairs. Right. I'm, listen, I'm going down with the ship. You know uh, what I'm saying? I asked these of the block camera. That's nobody the answer here. we were going no, to go on. There's okay. no bias on that side. But what I'm saying is <laughs> if the ship go down, I'm going down with the ship. Listen, but we what from New York. We from New York. We're going to stand right in the middle and watch the fight. We're from New York. If nothing happens. Okay, Nina Pinto. Do you feel like it's a stock drop? I do, because the thing is, when you look at all of the list and all of the comparative models of who's going to be the best battler of this year, this battle means a lot. If you win this battle 3-0, it almost catapults you to damn near the top of that list being who it is. If you lose this battle big time, it's not enough time in the year left to recover. Well, okay, so when you say if you win this battle, it catapults you to the top of your career. But for Geechee, some may say he has reached that. That he's already That he's here. reached this. Not his ceiling, but he's he's done pivotal things already. Oh, no, we're talking about for 2023 only. Okay. Only, right. only 2023. Got it. Yeah, Makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Only 2023. Gotcha. I mean, at the same time, Geechee Gotti has been winning. He's been winning over and over again. It's a level of fatigue. I mean, right. how many times can you battle and in a year? And we heard him say that yesterday at the face yeah. He's like, what do you want from me? You want me to win 10 times? Right? right. So what? He's in that Tyrese moment. What more do you want from me? So hopefully that right. he doesn't come out here like that. Hopefully he comes out here and still puts on a show no matter right. what. Because exactly. he wants to win. You know? Exactly. We need the hunger. The hunger. The hunger we need tonight from everyone. Right. Let's talk about a battle from early on in the card. Shayna Ashley, what's your thoughts about her versus Rosenberg Raw? I'll throw it to uh, Farrah first. Um, I feel like, like I said before, I feel like it's going to be an interesting battle. I feel like Rosenberg can be really disrespectful, but I feel like Shane is one of the ones that can hold her own. Like, sh like she's there. She's one of them. She's been around for a very long time. I don't feel like he's going to intimidate her. Um, I feel like he's going to have to move her. Yeah, some sh it's going to have to shake in here tonight. Listen, I'm looking forward to seeing Shayna in this setting. You know, we're used to seeing her in the ring. We've seen her once or twice on a stage, but this is a big moment. This is a big card. This is a big moment for Battle Rap, and I'm I'm happy that Shayna's up here, so I want to see what she does with the space. I want to see what she does with him. This is her first male battle as well. And she's been outside a lot lately. She has been She's outside. returning to she Battle Rap. She's getting Was acclimated. she really outside last time? You know what I'm saying? No, I she said kinda, now. I said you know now. What? She really is. She, she, she came off the porch. She did a so, cypher. She did a cypher. She, she rapped a lot. She, no, but she had a battle she I think battle. in San Diego or something like oh, that. Yeah. Carmina, not Car where in the world it's coming, San, San Diego. Diego. Hey, anyway, but, yeah. no, I'm saying for Shayna <laughs> Ashley, I think it's got a, she got a lot to prove because literally it she was kind it. of a it was a walk off. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. She got hit with the baseball and she walked the first base and they that walked is, everybody okay. else all the way home. You gotta deal with somebody that's actually willing to kill you and willing to smoke you. Rosenberg Raw just came out of a good ass fight. Like he just what came out of a good fight. Who fight? With Mike P. With Mike P. I know. With Mike P. That was a fight. They was fighting. Who yeah. was fighting? The Rosenberg, Raw, and Mike P. They was knuckling. Who they won? Talk to who him. Won? What? Who won? The, I mean, he, he said what? Where talk was the fight him. and who won? Well, well, it was, I'm saying it's a what fight. What had happened was. So, like, both of them, like, you know, you no, see the fight. No, one was punching and right. one was pulling here. Right, but but the other one had tracks missing though. It's so a lot of buttons. Okay. Okay. One bleeding and oh, the other one got stuff. Somebody had scrapes in your It was a scrap. Okay, you know what I'm okay, okay. Some would say somebody that, got dragged. Some would say that Rosenberg Raw has a loss. So what happens if you if they say you lost? I'm smoking anything that I see coming but in front of me. Again, he's been outside, and this battle is what like two weeks apart. Yeah, it's no, actually it's a week and a half. Week. It's like yeah. a week and a half. Like, he yeah, was literally just a day. So what do you think? I mean, well, the ring rust ain't. I mean, as far as ring rust for Rosenberg Raw, that's nothing. I think listen, maybe we don't play. Listen, we from New York. Right, we don't what do, do you no think, Bada? We're right, not doing no right, passes. Right, right, right. If you choose, you knew when you was battling. You knew it. So if you don't show up with three rounds tonight that are really fire on this card, we on you. You know what I'm saying? Hello. And, and if you're Tory Doe, my bad. Round. Hey, yo. 
<laughs> Shout out to Remy with Mon tonight. with Chrome 23, <laughs> man. We outside, ladies Tory and gentlemen. Shout out to Tory. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all put that hashtag Chrome 23. Yes. That's a fact. You yes. know what I'm saying? I mean, I can see the tweets. Do we have any great tweets that came up there? Because tonight we do what we want. We do what we want tonight. We doing what we want. I do what I want. So what do you think? The name of the card means I do what I want. Like, why is that name so special? You know damn well what she said. What Let's she get the real. She said. Give me the real. 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 I'm Why do you saying, think it's so special? Because of the fact that it gives you your own power. I do what I want. I want to do whatever I want to do. As long as that bag is there, I'm willing Hello. to do whatever yes. it takes. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing holding me back. And that's why I prefer to do what I want. You know what I'm saying? That's a good answer. I don't know. I don't know. What do you, how mean, do y'all feel? I do you feel like you're doing what you want? And, it, and I seen the name, it was like, ooh. Listen, when I what? see her pumping her own gas in Jersey, I said, oh, hey, she's yo. a rule breaker for real. <laughs> right. They don't let you pump your own gas in Jersey now. They and they had the know. foot up. Yeah. You know, I think she smoked a cigarette, blew what? up the, the gas station. It was crazy, you know. Set it on fire. Um, was walking on the do not walk sign. I said, oh, he is a sinner. And then Shayna climbed the gate, child. She did climb a gate. Then we had she, Charlie that told the man he's wearing his hat inside. They was breaking all the rules. I do what I and want. Then, and then Rosenberg threw the honey bun. He did. He, he, clerked, did throw the honey he, bun. he stole something. I've been meaning to talk to him about yeah. that. He's a thief. That's but we point. just got word from Avocado. He just said that we need to start talking about the first battle that's about to pop up. Oh and that's going to be C3 versus First Lady Flame. Yes. So yes. we should probably yes. get into them keys to victory. You know what I'm saying? Yes. We're going to get to them keys. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Get to them keys. Tr uh, truth be told, uh, yeah, we got the keys to victory right here. Right, I think right, for right. C3, the, her keys to victory, you know what I'm saying, I think she needs to, to keep that pin. She needs to maintain the fact that she is a elevated writer and stay within that and stay within that means. Uh, she's been on a run already, so she should already be rinsing and repeating what she's already doing. And the only issue that I've been having with C3 lately is that there's been a couple dry spots. Yeah, I'm loving those witty lines, but you got a couple dry spots that you kind of got to get out of. And don't overreact if they don't react to your overreaction. You get what I'm saying? Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? As far as First Lady Flames, she usually loses the coin toss. You know what I'm saying? So, like, typically, what does that got to do with anything? It got to do, do a lot. Know that Right. Lost the damn Did you Talk to Listen, I done did my research. I done watched every time that First Lady Flames is battled. Typically, if you go first, don't that mean you lost that coin toss? No, because sometimes you just might feel like going first. Normally, if the coin toss is lost, they usually they usually get rid of that thing. But only thing I'm saying is, uh, uh, for First Lady Flames, she needs to keep doing what she's been well, doing. Let's stick to C3. Let's see what everybody has for C3. What are your keys to victory, Vada? For, for C3, C3, the keys to victory are pretty simple. She needs to maintain the tournament aggression. She came through the tournament. She ran through a lot of opponents in a quick time. And what she was doing was staying with a good flow. She had punches. She had good material that sounded like it was written pretty quick, even with a tournament stance. And she needs to work through the lows. Sometimes in battles, there will be high moments and there will be lows. But she needs to keep her foot on the gas for the whole battle. I feel like C3 needs to come in here with no freestyles. I don't want no playing. Maybe a rebuttal or two, but no freestyles. Everything written, everything fresh, memory off the charts. And I feel like she needs to keep her confidence throughout the battle. I don't want her, you know, if something doesn't land, just work through it. Just keep going through that space. And I think that C3 will hit the mark tonight. What do you think? Um, I feel like she just, I feel like I want her to get to the punches. No long drawn out schemes. I want her to like, Feed the crowd what they need. This this is a different environment. It's a little gritty. I know she's used to like different atmospheres. Right. So I just want her to get into that moment. Like this is a moment right it now. Is. And it I is. want her to feel it and understand what's happening right now and get into that zone. Uh, I could tell them how to. I'd rather show them how to. Uh, like one more time with it Right Check this here uh, Had to hustle crack 
Tell them double that I gave them two for nine And the other five bubble wrap Put scriptures in these songs You can blame it on my diary Thanks for the inquiry Now what you trying to buy from me I tell you how it goes I'm as lively as any Like who you know that's under 40 That retired already Shit I grew up in the hood Overseeing the projects Now I'm the one in charge Overseeing the project I had to get the profit You rapping niggas stop it I got the same poise as Josh Allen in the pocket, I stood in front of the judge and a G ain't stutter. I buck niggas with the heat like I'm PJ Tucker, motherfucker. What made you do a four battle card this time? Um, my first home event, the Queens Get the Money, was four battles. Okay. And I think four is good. Five is five is cool too, mm-hmm. but I feel like when you have four solid ones. You, you'll you do. This one originally, I told people, it originally had five, right? Mm-hmm. And, you know, we lost one at the last minute, but I felt like the other four was strong enough to where I didn't really have to replace it. Okay. But, um, I think it's going to be a great night. I don't know who's going to be performing for the night. Right. I don't know. That's the most exciting like, part. We don't know. said we need a body. The streets we need, need a body. We need a body. Need a body. <laughs> streets need a body. Shout out to DNA. Are you out here going down with the shit? And we got I Philly. am. Are you? Oh, that's I mean, crazy. Listen. I, am I didn't a think fan. you wanted to see nobody no. get body. I'm a fan before everything. <laughs> That's so true. the the league owner me, I want a classic. I want right. replay value. I want all those things. But the fan in me is like, nah, I want somebody dead, completely <laughs> gone. They need a I, body. Me Make me erase their contact. Never I'm call them again. Oh, Never call me again. <laughs> Delete them. But um, I don't think that's going to happen. I right. really, I strongly don't believe we're going to get any of that because every single match I feel like can go either way. Okay. I feel like, I feel like this card, for, even for it having four battles, it's a heavy card. It is. It's definitely a heavy card. Everybody on the card has a pin. Everybody on the card, they definitely focus when the time is right. So I feel like everybody's going to come out here and show out tonight. Four battles and, and they're strong battles. They really are. Pro 23, I do what I want. No place like Chrome. I'm out of here. No I'm out of here. Like so about to start, guys. Shout out to Remy Ma yes, in the building. Yes, less than five minutes away, guys. Yes, I'm yes. starting Chrome 23. I do what I want. Please. What we doing? Still let us. We doing what, what we, we doing? want. We doing what we want. What I we do doing? what I want. I'm doing what I want. Oh, I want to do what, what I want. want. We do what we want out here. Let us know what you guys are thinking. Right now, how do you feel about the energy in the building? There's quite a few people here right now. I ain't going to lie. The, 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 the building is packing up right now, but I need that energy to be just a little bit more for the ladies. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're going to set this tone. But there's some good going. ladies in the building. I'm seeing some sexiness out here. They got the VIP popping. The drinks is flowing. They, they got, got definitely. Hookah, tops. It's a nice space. The right? My beverage is delicious, by the way. I just want to let y'all know that. Right, 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 right. Yes. Man. I'm excited, guys. So, guys, oh, we're live from Chrome 23. Absolutely. We got a C3. We got First Lady Flames going down. We got we need a quick prediction from each person. Ah, why would we do a predictions? On the spot. Oh, on the spot. I thought we were supposed go. to just be doing Let's this. Go. Let's go. All right, listen, I'm going to keep it real with you. As much as I love C3, C3 is a legend. Yeah. But First Lady Flames going to have to smoke something. And I think tonight is going to be that night that, C, that First Lady Flames smokes. Not only somebody that's willing to smoke, but a legend too. Yeah. Shooting. I love them both. But I'm sticking with my old school lady. C3, you better come in here and kick some royal behinds. All right? Very. C3, we are original class, girl. Let's go. I'm going to have to. Well, she ain't an original. That's what I mean. I love them both. They my sisters. But I'm really like, I'm going to go with Flames. 2 1. Okay. Are, are, what we doing? I, 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 I said Flames. So what's on you? What you got? Well, wait, you want to even it out? You want flames, C3, flames? Yes, sir. Yes. Queens get the money. I'm going wow. with Queens. All right. C3. We you know, well, we, we had to split like it that. out the middle. I like you know that. what I mean? Right, so I like that. I love First Lady Flames, though. I but was going to say winner or loser buys drinks, but each of us. Yeah, oh, whoever, you're the only one with. A person off the losing with team. The who? No, me oh, and no. SP got. Got flames. Yeah, the losing team. All right, all right, I'm about to so say, so the loser, so the loser team, gotta get on yeah. this cam losing and say that they to apologize and buy drinks. Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, I'm with it. Wait, I'm going down with the ship once now, again. Who's your team? Who do you uh, guys have winning? Hashtag Chrome 23. Yes, <laughs> but I thought y'all was the team. No, because no. we both going for flames. Okay, all right. I'm cool with Team Flames, Team C3. There we go. There we go. Hashtag Team C3. 
or Team Flames, whoever you got winning this yeah, battle. Right, you right, know, right. Chrome 23. And a couple of announcements before we get started. You know, uh, rest in peace, Pat. Stay free to wave, Sue Surf. Yes, you know what yes. I'm saying? Free got to show love on the stream. Shout out to all the battle rappers out there, all the media. Y'all are the reason why this type of stuff happens. Shout out to Remy Ma, Chrome 23. Hashtag Chrome 23. I do what I want. Make sure y'all run them hashtags up. We going up tonight. We trying to be trending. And just so y'all know, keep tweeting. You might see a tweet on the screen. I see quite a few of those tweets on the screen. We about to start reading them for y'all in a minute. Yep. And it better not be no hate or no slander Hello. about this commentary. That's all I'm saying. I'm with all the smoke. I be seeing them. I be seeing them. So what do you guys feel, right? So we know we had a bomb that happened yesterday at the um, face Off. Remy officially announced that Chrome 23 is no longer yes, an all-female yes, yes. league. Farrah, I'm going to start with you because you're a female. Let's go. I mean, and you was from a league. <laughs> and it's no longer an all-female league. How do you feel? You know, like, I was like, Whoa. You were hurt, right? Whoa. 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 Oh, Did she just say that? Did like, we kind of felt it. Rock, but we never knew for sure. Because you know what? Easy said he was the face, and then I was trying to figure out what did that mean? Right. Like, was he, you know, or was he, I didn't. Right, 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 right. I mean, let's, let's, as, as a fan, as a fan, you know what I'm saying? It, there is a bad rap that comes with being an all-female league. Yeah, understood. So it typically, does. if Sometimes you are, if you are doing the league, especially Remy Ma, that's a lot of money on the it table. Is. So they got to think about them pluses and Listen, minuses. If you were in the red, do what you got to do gotta to get to the You, you, you know, you in the red, make sure nobody don't end up. There. You <laughs> know what it is. Right, right, right. <laughs> but I mean, for her to say that this is now. More is open season for everybody. Right. That's other bags that's out there for other Absolutely. people. It There's plenty of battlers out here that what, want to do what, what they want. My thing is when she says it's like a co-ed now, a co-ed lead. Does she continue to book more female battles on the cards, or will she like venture off and make more all male cards? I think it's essential to keep the females involved, you know, because that was Absolutely. the premise that it was built on. So when you build something off of that, you got to keep the females involved. We need the C3s versus the First Lady Flames. We Absolutely. need the Fair Funerals, the Shuni, the Rappers. We need them integrated in this because if it becomes just an all-male league, it's just any old all-male league. There's nothing wrong with that, mm -hmm. but the females definitely need to be a continue positive to be put as well as right. you get to see a male versus a female every time more than likely, and, like and that makes it a staple. It you know yeah. what I mean? The way yeah. she set up this card, Absolutely. Um, she balanced it out. You got one female. Um, all female battle. You got yep. a male and a female. And then you have two male male on male battles. Yeah. It definitely makes sense. It does and give it, a lot and of it does still showcase the women. Absolutely. And Remy does a lot for the battle rap community. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? She's going to make sure you look good. She's going to make sure that oh, the people sure. are treated well. You know what I'm saying? I I, I got to let yeah, they, they, the they, the camera. they got to eat the camera. You know they got to eat the camera today. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Amen. This is for not real. about me. This is about Farrah and Shuni. You know what I'm saying? And we live from Chrome 23. Uh, right. The ladies are getting mic'd up. Yes. Yeah. Me and Shuni are gonna go down it, it looks like yeah it looks like we're about to kick off so you guys will see us in the field mm -hmm. and we're gonna get some yes. questions from them and see how they feel that's so. right we yeah, so what we so what we will be doing is once the battle is over, we'll be doing interviews live with the artists, find out how they feel. We got a good, bunch of good commentators down here that's gonna do their thing, and it's gonna be a lot of fun tonight. Hashtag Chrome Twenty Three. I do what I want. Yes, yes, yes. Gang. And we about to get into the first battle right now. Shout out to Rem. I'm really here to wax these bitches. All hands and grips. That's why this pussy on a thin line, landing strip. So I just. How many threats you recite to me of doing things we both know you will not? Stop it. Shit, unless one of the bulls helping, bitch, you going in a full Nelson. It's gonna look like you pop locking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. I'm from the rich. So when shit get lit, even the youngin' squeeze. Kitty table at the cookout. Everybody got a drum of peace, but battle rap. And I ain't saying the rest of them had to be on drugs and things, but I'm just assuming they wasn't half right. Cause the only people I seen sucking flames be using a glass pipe. So I don't. I really didn't want to write this shit. <laughs> but if 
queens get the money, why you ain't bubble off that quarter? Hell, we locked 14 out of seven just off stretching it in the water, but I'm disappointed. I know, I know. They really hating I'm the chrome champ. You're gonna have to create your own name and make your own stance. But I am three, I am God. I don't fucking lose in flames. You need to just come with me to bag some bitches. You know you don't like fucking dudes. From now on. Tonight we are in the field. Who the hell do y'all think won this? We ain't waiting till you go outside to talk to you for 15 minutes of fame. Who won, who won? I think I got first and third, maybe, first maybe. This is I do what I want, we doing what we want. Do you think you won or not? I don't think the third, I don't think the third was hers. You don't think the third was hers? Who we got? Who we got? What? To what? To what? Oh, you gotta come down. I'll give it up for the ladies. We gonna throw it back to Butterfly and SP on the stage. We are live from Chrome 23. I got my brother with me. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Yes, 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 and they're starting to pack the building. C3 versus First Lady Flames just went down. Uh, you know, I, I'm talking to get you. We know this battle has some audio issues. What are we doing? Man, listen, I'm going to be real with you, Vada. You know what I'm saying? I tried to enjoy that battle myself, man. I really was voting for, I was rooting for First Lady Flames, but C3 had the mic working for us. She had the crowd working for us. She, everything was working on C3's favor, man. So I got to get that battle to C3, whether in the building or on that stream. How y'all calling it in the crowd? What, what you think, Vada? Well, I mean, you know, C3 definitely had a mic that worked better for her tonight, you know what I mean? And you had uh, First Lady Flames had some dope material. I felt like her third was good. Her second was dope, too. And C3 had a slight little, little, little stumble in, like, what was it, the first round or second round? It was but second. it wasn't nothing. I'm not taking nothing away from no her. Dude. But what I'll say, with the audio issues and everything, I went for C3, 2-1 with the first and the third round. Yeah, I can't get mad at that, man. You know what I'm saying? We are here, Chrome 23. I do what I want. Make sure y'all get that hashtag in there, man. Make sure y'all put the hashtag, Chrome 23, and put C3 and First Lady Flames and tell us who you think won that joint, because we don't know. Right, right. And like he said, live from I do what I want. Make sure y'all get the hashtag going. Get your screenshots. Post them on your grams, your social media, and just get things going. You know, I'm here with my brother, Showtime SP. He's got the sorry I was watching battle rap. I've got the He Got Smoke from RiceGangClothing.com. Salute to my brother. Uh, as far as the battle went tonight, is there anything you felt like C3 could have did different? I think C3 was floating. She was doing everything that she could have. She still had a couple dry spots, but I felt like she was rolling around. Like she was rolling all the way through. I felt like First Lady Flames never got off a of gear too. She stayed at one level, and she just stayed at that same pace. Now, granted, at that same pace, she had some bars within there. She was cooking like she was supposed to be cooking, but at the same time, mic issues and all that type of deflection. I, I, C3 kind of got that. She walked away, man. Yeah, and like you said, you know, you have Flames who came in here with a game plan, I'm pretty sure. But after a while, when you're dealing with the static, the static, the static, it, it kind of, somebody goes up around. Then they can potentially go up another round. You know what I'm saying? And I hope during this intermission right here, a lot of the audio issues will be worked out because, like I said, there's a lot of people want to see this card and see these battles on the card. But, man, let's get to it, man. We got a lot of battles on this card. We got three more left. And I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hate, man. I, I like the fact that that first battle has set the tone, but it didn't give me that energy just yet. I'm gonna need that energy to turn all the way up. The building's about to pack in here. It's a couple stars in here. It's actually a little star studded. This is a battle rap crowd. Let's let's get let's get that out the way. This is a battle rap crowd for sure. Yeah, it's definitely a battle rap crowd. Shout out to everybody watching the event. Shout out to all the kids at home. Shout out to the wives, the kids, the mothers, the families, everybody that's watching this joint. You know what I'm saying? We live from Chrome 23. Is there a battle? Talk to me about Rosenberg Raw versus Shayna Ashley, which is more than likely gonna be next. Man, listen, I just got my I got my eye on Rosenberg Raw right now, and that man looked determined. He looked determined to kill something. He looked determined to smoke something. I haven't seen Shayna just yet. But I believe she should probably be in the shadows lurking right now, planning that game plan out, man. It's, it's going to be a good battle. I think that's What's next. What's the vibe like? We live from Camden, New Jersey. You know what I'm saying? Live from the trenches. I see Shayna Ashley just walked in the building. A lot of other people are walking in here. What's the most exciting battle for you tonight? To me, it's definitely the main event. I don't care what anybody says. I know the people came coming in right now, but this building is going to be packed to the max when it comes to this main event tonight. I got to go. Like I said, I'm going 2-1 on my side. I got to. 
until you tell me otherwise, you know what I'm saying? But let's talk about the other battle that I really think I'm going to be a fan of because my GOAT Charlie Clips is going to be in the building tonight versus one of the hardest working men in battle rap doing whatever he wants. A Ward versus Charlie Clips. Obviously, that's going to be a dynamic battle between two dope performers. You know, you got A Ward's ability to freestyle, Charlie Clips' ability to freestyle. Who going to freestyle more? I don't know, man. I, I think it's going to be, it's, it's up to the second round. I'm still feeling like that second round is going to be a crazy rebuttal. The third round, it could be a toss up depending on how Charlie Clips want to go. If we're going to get all full, fully loaded three rounds, Charlie Clips, I don't think there's nothing that A Ward could do. But. But how important is this battle for A-Ward's legacy this year? Man, for real, for real, the, what's going to happen for A-Ward is if A-Ward beats Charlie Clips, he can actually have that debate of clearing out that top ten for the for the champion of the year, battle of the year, because of the fact that he is that journeyman. Like, A-Ward ain't, he ain't ducking no smoke. Now, he's been getting knocked out a couple times, typically when it's somebody of the other hue. You know, there's the same hue. It's going to look dark on his side, pun intended. Well, you know, the thing for A-Ward is his freestyle ability, his ability to rebuttal, and he's just coming off of one of the battles of the year versus A-Verb. Shout out to A-Verb. You know, he stood in front of that clock 40 on you. Woo! Listen, I'm about to say, I was going to start it off with it. If he going to say clock 40 on you in that battle, in this one, he going to have to bring out the Chrome 23. You feel me? He going to have to have something for it. And when you're dealing with uh, A-Ward coming off of a card like Max out, Max out, is easily considered the card or one of the cards of the year. And now he's stepping onto this stage with literally less than two weeks from when he just battled. How can he be prepared? I don't even think that man iced his wounds yet. I don't even think all of his wounds fully healed up yet. He still got some galls off of his arms. He still got some, some bandages that he need to get out. The stitches ain't even been removed yet. And yet he going right back at it with somebody that's willing to swing on him. Hard. Now, are we getting three rounds written Charlie Clips tonight, or are we getting the freestyle version? I don't know. I haven't seen Clips yet. If I see Clips in the building, that let me know he ready. If I don't see Clips until that battle start, we might be getting some pulling out the crowd, give me a word, any of those type of things from Clips. That's how I feel. Right. I, I mean, I think for Charlie Clips, this is a crucial battle because if A-Ward has a debatable, a lot of people have him winning. A lot of people have A-Verb winning too. But if he be, wins that battle and then comes into this one and does it again, it's very possible. It's, it's very, very possible. You might have to, you might have to get the leather shorts out because it's going to be a star-studded, star-studded event. You know, well, what I'm I, I mean, we, we chose to go with a lighter choice of word robes today. You know, we knew the reaction, but we're wearing RiceGangClothing.com today. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You push your own brand, rock your own stuff. Sorry, I was watching Battle Rap, so everybody who's home today could tell their significant other girlfriend job. Sorry, I'm not available. I'm watching Battle Rap, and don't get smoked. Hey, man, and I, I appreciate that. Uh, you know that shout out because that's definitely something that happens all the time with me. So I asked Vod. I said, so you wore the leather shorts last time. This time, are you going to wear the leather jacket or the leather sleeves? He's like, no, nah, we gonna wear my shit. I said, you know what? I ain't mad at that, bro. I ain't mad at none of that. Uh, they checking out the audio right now. Uh, shout out to Fox 5 for continuing Thanks. to stream us and continuing to keep the battle rap culture engaged. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody over there with our family. Shout out to all of our subscribers. Shout out to everybody on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Watching Chrome 23 today. You know what I'm saying? Ready for the easy versus Geechee. It's a lot of talk that's going to be solved today. What did you think about the face off last night? I ain't going to. I'm going to keep it whole real with you with the, with the face offs. It seemed a little too friendly. I mean, they looked like they was jabbing at each other, but at the same time, it looked a little bit too friendly, if you ask me. I feel like with Remy in the middle, she kind of was, in the, you know, was kind of on easy side. I felt like it was a little bias on that side for easy. I mean, but that's your manager, you know what I'm saying? But then again, you did pay this killer to kill your number one agent. I don't know how I feel about this, man. I don't know. I know you from Philly, you know what I'm saying? So I definitely have to keep my eye on the bias hat on, you know what I'm what? saying? I have to keep my eye on the bias hat today. I don't have no idea what you're talking about. You're talking about bias. I have no idea what you're you talking about. You see what you're wearing right now? What? You see what you're wearing? What? I'm wearing a, I'm sorry, I was watching Battle Rap. Shout out to the city of Philadelphia. The city of Philadelphia has won two football games. Two football games. Before the Giants scored a point. Oh. Because yeah, I was waiting for that. I was waiting for any type of smoke. I was going to say, we got more points than what y'all put up. Hey, hey listen, man. Uh, t hard, tough times don't last, but tough people do. You know what I'm saying? So, uh. We got one of our lovely color commentators back in the building today. Absolutely. None other than the lovely Shuni, the rapper. She Hello. Come on, come on. You get on there in a minute. Spotlights on Shuni, not on are. you. <laughs> <laughs> not on 
Nah, shout out to my brother Showtime I'm SP. Back, I'm we're back I'm with back. Shuni. Uh, how'd you feel about the battle? You know, everything included. Keep it a hundred. We know what okay, you do. Okay, so obviously there was some mic issues. We'll talk sure, about the sure. elephant in the room. Um, I think that took a little bit of the energy out of them, but all in all, I thought they had a good battle. You know what I mean? Um, I, it's debatable right now because I really can't call it. Going into the third, I had C3 winning two rounds, but she kind of messed up in her second. So yeah, I was I a little unsure. I thought the material was there, but her messing up a little bit in her second, I'm like, damn, you probably could get flames that second too. So I really don't know. I do, as of right now, have it debatable. How you calling it, Fair? What's up, Fair? I feel like that's pure. No, but I because I don't always give somebody. Listen, y'all know I'm I be gonna, fucking up. So I don't, ooh, excuse me. Y'all know I be messing up. They argue so like I sisters. I don't for always real. give somebody the round for a and mess you, up. Just say you're not trying to lose the bet and say sorry. And no, apologize. I'm not saying that. I will. Just apologize. I got it debatable. I will you apologize. Can't do it debatable. It's a, it's a one or the other. One so you have flames winning clearly. I have flames winning two and three. Really? I feel like C three. I won't are, debate that. All right. Now apologize. I had right, uh, C three with sorry. the first and the third. Oh, you still had C three winning. C? No, no, I don't. Have, I, but I don't have C3 winning in the third. Oh, you don't? The second is debatable to me. No, I had it one. I had it. Yeah, no. Yeah. But I can't lie. You had it one time. No, I didn't. I really. No, no. I was about to say that. But, but you no. said that. I had to think about it, girl. But as you can see, that was the issues that, that we've been issue. having. You know what I'm saying? Right. The audio issues. No. I'm going to be real with you, Fair. We won. Oh, we, 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 we didn't. We, we didn't. I feel I'm with you. I'm with you. You have it debatable as well? I, I don't have it debatable. I have C3 clearly winning. Oh, you do? I do. Okay. Because, and I'm going to tell you why. Everything was on c 3 side. The mic was on her side. The crowd was on her side. The energy was on her side. I can see that I felt as well. like that uh, I was telling everybody here that I felt like First Lady Flames never left gear two. I also feel like First Lady Flames had short rounds. Yes. So that's yeah. why I was like, oh, I kind of got to see 3 2 0 right now. And then Flames third was amazing. Yeah, Flames third was fire. Team, team C3. But that's why right. I said, okay, I gave Flames the second and the third. I feel like C3 died down a little bit in the third. Her, her first was like, right. she came out the gate punching. The third is when she gave us what we didn't ask for was the long drawn out um, schemes and stuff. Right. She gave us the rebuttal that was a little. Yeah, that fell flat. Yeah, I think the rebuttal fell short too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I don't know. I don't. I just. I got it debatable. I'm gonna stick with what I said. I got it debatable. I'm gonna say sorry for now, cause I can't rewatch it right now. So I'm gonna say sorry. Appreciate that. You got that. So nobody wins out of that sorry, first Bobby. one because it's kind of she's got it debatable. I'm sorry about it. I don't nobody know. Nobody wins when the family feuds. I'm gonna just apologize. We I'm gotta sorry. be a little clear. Right, right. We, we got, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, you know what? Another thing is, we had audio issues, so, you know, yeah, we really, yeah. so, so we'll Mike push us through really the do we, Right, do we really know? But then, that goes back to our previous question about killing your adrenaline. Right. Yeah. Because I feel like when the mic started messing up for real, and Flames had a minute to sit there while they were trying to fix it, I see her energy just kind yeah. of died kind of down. Yeah, and then she mentioned she was hungry. Yeah. She had a lot of things that she had to work she through on the stage. Right. So. Right. But as a battle rapper, you know, you guys have done it at the highest level. You've been on multiple cards, multiple leagues. What do you do? Because you prepare one way. You don't prepare for the mics to start going around, the right. sound system. Like, how do you rebound from that? I mean, in that moment, I feel like you got to improvise. You know what I mean? Like, Mike fucking up, just take these shit, take them off right yeah. now. I would have probably just took them off and, and winged okay. Yeah, did something to kind of get the energy back on your crowd. I probably would have snatched the mic off, too. To get the crowd back, I do something. You know what I mean? If she had, a, if I had on my jacket like flames, I would have took my jacket off. You know the crowd goes crazy. That's a cheat code. When you take your jacket off, they're like, yeah. yeah. So because you know of, what I mean, I would have did something to get that energy we back on my we side. Had a moment, um, yeah. When we did the two on two. We did. And it was just like, whoa. Yeah. Right. Like the crowd wasn't really catching. They weren't. Yeah. It. yeah. And I looked at her and my energy was just dying. You yeah. hyped me, me. I hyped you, and I'm and yeah. Like, so yeah. the gamble is real. So yeah. like yeah. it's, it's basically taking Absolutely. the gamble if you yeah. decide yeah. to rebuttal. Yeah. Do you know? Are you thinking about this mid round for the rebuttal, or is it more like as soon as they round done, you just go over to the corner and say, like, like this is what we're gonna try to do? It depends on what they say. If they have something that's really a room shaker, you do want to rebuttal, but you gotta make sure that your your rebuttal yeah. is tight. Cause if yeah. it falls flat, yeah, yeah, that can mess you up. I'm, I see not the a, I'm not a I'm not a rebuttaler. <laughs> yeah, I was about to ask you about I, that. I don't, is it I a don't big deal, risk? I don't 
touch it. I did it once. Well, I did it twice in my career. <laughs> and you hated it, right? It was like, whoa. It was so bad. Yeah. And I did rebuttal against clips, and that one was really fire. It was, yeah, it was good. Yeah. So, yeah. I, I don't touch the rebuttal thing. I'm not really trying to focus on what you're saying to counteract, because I can't even remember my own stuff. I like to rebuttal, but I, my thing is, it's always a gamble, because now if I rebuttal and I forget my real material, That's which why? happens to me often. That's why I, I said, don't want to go down that road. I'm not doing that. Because I'll be the one to start rebuttaling and then go to your ground. I, re I don't remember that. I know, right? Yeah. Then I'm like, SP, where the phone at? Where the phone at? Where the phone at? Right, right, right. What's the next one? What's the next one? Let me get some. Uh, some water. Some water, that water in here. <laughs> yeah. We have, yeah. So it's, it is something that you have to work on okay. to try to be prepared for everything. You know what I mean? So sometimes when I practice, I like to practice with music on. I like to practice with people talking to me and everything because I like to be ready for those things that could happen. Yep. Hey. Yeah. All right. I see. Shout That's out. okay. Give me this. Shout out. But yeah, so. Chrome 23. Chrome 23. I do what I want. Are the hashtags working? Are yeah. we trending yet? Hashtag Chrome 23. We want to know what you feel about that first battle. Sound aside, we know we had Make those sure issues. That's the obvious. But what did you feel about the battle? What did you feel about the material? Who you guys had winning? Exactly. I'm excited for the next battle that's coming up. We got yeah. Shayna Ashley versus Rosenberg Raw. What do you think the key takeaways for them are? For Rosenberg Raw, he's got to remember the fact that he just battled last week. You know, right. having a battle within 14 days of your last battle, we're we're fatigued and we're just commentating two weeks in a row. So I got to understand the Max. mental preparation. And I would ask you guys as battlers, what is it like having a battle in such a small window? I know you guys don't do it often, but what is the preparation like? Well, when I had a battle, I had um, I did the tournament. And um, we know how that went. And then the very next day I battled Kid Chaos. I literally was so focused on a tournament that I had to wake up the next morning to write for Kid Chaos. I did decent, but I would have loved more prep time. It is hard prepping under short time, but I don't know. Maybe he knew about this battle ahead of time and he was able to juggle the two. Because sometimes you can write simultaneously and then focus down within a week. As long as you have like seven to eight days to memorize and really write your stuff, that does happen sometimes too. So it, de it just depends on the amount of time. But for me personally, I would like to have at least three weeks prep in, in between my battles so that I can give clean performances. You know, but if the bag is right, I might battle two days in a row. Who knows? I got a major question. You? I got a major question. This I'm not. I'm not a back-to-back -back kind of battle rapper. I barely even battled this year. So I'm not never taking battles back-to-back. -back. My life is too chaotic for that. So um, I feel like Rosenberg just battled. We discussed that. He just had a battle. My thing is, who did he take more seriously? That's a good question. Because I would think Mike Peake. For sure, oh, Mike Peake. Why? But, but is, now, this, is, this a, is this a thing? Hold on. Uh, Don't but, take the female <laughs> serious? Is right. this a thing? But th let, let me, let me, let me counteract with that. But now you no. said Mike P, right? So if he comes out here and loses to Shayna tonight, and he says, oh, well, I didn't take it seriously, do we crucify him for yes. that? Or go, yes. hey, you know what? It's okay because it was a female. He doesn't so get a pass. He will not get a pass. I feel like you shouldn't have to take it lightly no matter the opponent. It don't matter whether you're a male or a female. You could be battling a dog, a piece of cheese. It don't matter if I'm doing a voiceover. It don't matter if I'm if I'm doing a one-off. Right. You should keep that same energy in every time for anybody. Right, My right. question for y'all is, is it the preparation for an intergender battle different? Like, do you write differently for a guy? Are you, like, thinking, this is some shit I'm going to write for all the women, for all the men? Or is this, no, this is written specifically for you? I mean, there's certain things that you can say to a guy that you can't say to a girl. But as far as preparation, I think it should be the same. You know what I mean? You need to write your punches. You need to be heavy. You need to focus. So I think all of that should be the same. And if Rosenberg comes out here playing with Shayna because she's a female and rapping like, oh, I want to have sex with you, he's going to die. For SP, what do you have for specific keys to victory for Rosenberg Raw? They're pulling them up now. Oh, my bad. Yeah, so some specific keys for uh, Rosenberg Raw is that nobody really has the edge in this. So you got to treat, you got to basically, this could either be the sleeper battle, like y'all should have been watching this battle, or this could be the smoke break battle, and you see that he really just let off the gas for Mike P. As far as fair, you got any keys to victory for um, Rosenberg Raw? I feel Raw? like my keys to victory for um, Rosenberg Raw 
Rosenberg is to stay in the game. Like, don't take her lightly. I feel like he has to come out here and, and act like she was Mike P last week because we did hear he lost. So I feel like he better come out here with his foot on the gas from round one. Yeah. Shorty. For me, it's simple. Like I said, do not come out here taking that typical female angle that some, most guys do when they battle a female and push that pen. Like, he's been outside, he's been in different settings, so I know that he has an advantage there. But I really want to see what he can do with Shayna because Shayna is a heavy, heavy pen. So that's the only way he's going to win. Let's flip the coin to Shayna Ashley. You got anything for Shayna Ashley tonight? I'm going to keep it real with you. Shayna Ashley got to be explosive. She's going to have to say something to Rosenberg Raw that ain't been said or at least give it to us in a different way that's never been done before. I mean, Rosenberg Raw is definitely a journeyman too, so he's been, he's been bloodied, he's been battered. So... What is it that Chayna could do to put the nail in the coffin? She wanted to get a little personal. Yes. Yeah. Streets need a body still, though. I didn't get one they in the do. last battle. We didn't, we didn't one. get one yet. We Did didn't anybody get, get run over? Nothing? Like, well, I think Shayna can, give, and Hink, I know, right? battle, I mean, Shana battle, can give a body if she works that room. Do not be a one-trick pony. We need to see something different from Shayna Ashley tonight. She needs to really come out here and show that she's back. That's the key to victory for Shayna. What do you think, Farrah? Um, I definitely agree with you. Um, you know, I named her the female Biggie for a reason. You did. Yes, yeah, she did. I feel like she's one of them ones, and she has potential to come out here and kill um, Rosenberg tonight. I feel like she needs to know the room. She needs to know the crowd that she's rapping in front of. But tonight, I feel like she's definitely going to have to fight for reaction. I was but the crowd does not seem biased. That's true. They definitely are that's giving true. it up for stuff that, you know, they hear and that's fire. Yeah, I was about to ask. I would say that she needs to know her environment. She has to bring big stage bars, you know. The bars that the fans love that they pay to come in here, in here for are the big stage moments. The Glock 40s, the Crown Vixens. We need the, <laughs> we need them big moments. Know the environment. Switch it up. You're going to have to rap against Rosenberg Raw. Yeah. Bring that, bring that smoke. Against Rosenberg, we really need to see a style progression. Like, we want to see how she's evolved from Queen of the Ring over the years and what she's really bringing in this new age style of battle rap, being that she's back outside. Because a lot of these new girls want to battle Shayna. You know what I mean? So I want to see her really switch that up tonight and give us but something. But when we say she's back outside, right? We right. just seen her recently. We did. We seen the showing. We did. But there wasn't really a showing because... Tori didn't show up. Right. So do you feel like if Tori would have rapped that night, that it wouldn't have made Shayna's bar so heavy or the moment so monumental? Right. I mean, I think if, if Tori rapped that night, it would have been a different story. I think Shayna probably would have felt a little bit of blood in her mouth that night if Tori actually rapped. So I would hate for tonight to be the first time in a long time that she's feeling some pain. You know what I mean? I am that's a hard to do when you're on the stage and somebody gives you a hit, yeah. it's hard to come back from that. Well, the thing is, too, Chayna Ashley is a contract killer, right? Right. How would you feel if you was a contract killer and you woke to your spot where you're supposed to do the contract kill and that person already had a heart attack? <laughs> what do you expect it to do? Do you still still shoot them? Do you still do what you're supposed to do? Like, um, no, you got to... That's a good question. Put your foot on their neck. That's <laughs> what you're supposed to do. Was in that was insane. That's him. That was I insane. just watch. I just watch, but I'm just saying. But once again, I definitely have to say thank you to Shuneral. It's their first thank time doing you. this, you know what I'm yes. saying, at a high level. How does it feel, you know what I'm saying? You're, you're in front of you, giving your commentary, your With thoughts. the best two-on-two -two bloggers. It. it feels great. I'm, I'm loving, loving the energy it. in the building. I'm loving the energy. Yes. The people on Twitter, oh, keep tweeting. Hashtag from 23. Your tweets are popping up. We are yes. going to be reading them. Going down. We're reading, we're retweeting. We want to see what you think about the show. We want to see what you think about everything. You know, because there's no let place like Chrome. You hear me? Home and we do what we want. We do what we want. Yes, yes. And to feedback into. Here we are. So we're, Shout out to Director Remy. You we got the director in here. Yes. We got the director in here. She's the, telling the us what to do. The perfect shot to make sure that we write I'm tonight. I'm super excited for this next battle. Neither one of them have ever had an intergender battle. So I'm really excited to see what they're going to do in this moment. You know what I mean? What is going to be the strategy? Are you going to come out the gate slow? Or are you going to come out trying to knock each other's head off? Is he going to be in her face? Is she going to be in his face? Like, I'm really excited to see what they're going to do tonight. I feel like the person that goes first sets the tone yes. for this battle tonight. So they got to lose the coin toss is what you're saying. You anyway. Know you, are, you know, you know what? what? Makes sense. As the coin got tossed and she lost, I 
say, you know what? He was right. He was right. Think of me when but he's battling to lose these coin I toss. never want you to be a battle rapper because that's never. all you're going to do is I'm lose the coin toss. I'm not worry about the coin toss. I'm going to have two different rounds. If I win the coin toss, I'm going to go straight that's to what tough. I got. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, special announcement. Remy is changing between every battle. You know what I'm saying? So when she pops back on the screen, she really it'll did. be a different look for the fellas out there. She looks amazing. Yeah. Yes. Not to mention, shout out to Remy too, like because it's, it's the it's, it's the it's the vibe body. that I love from Remy too. When she tell you to move, you won't move. Like she told somebody in the crowd, shut up. He ain't said nothing since. Right. He hasn't talked since. Actually. When he leave, he'll be talking. You know again. the thing oh, that I like again. is, you be quiet Remy, right now. Though. Remy is super hands on with the production. She's in here talking about Mike. She's over here telling people how to stand, fix your hair. What is it? She's really in tune with everything. She's not just leaving it into somebody else's hands to make the production right. So I really like to see that going on. That's really dope. Okay, so we got to get to a we got to get to a crucial point. Rosenberg Raw versus Shane Ashley who wins? Let's go around. This one is for the marbles. We didn't get no drinks last time, but this one is for the for the run. I'm going to go with the fellas on this one. And because it's in the gender, I'm typically going to go with the men's side. Don't look at me like that. I, I got the same anatomy. I got to go with that side. I'm just so you going down with the ship? Yes. You going that's down. The, that's the model. You know going with baby. the ship. Man, I'm going with Shay Shay. You ain't even got to ask Hello. me, okay? Hello. Queen of the ring. What? Give it up Originators. for the what? We going for with the, the women. ladies. What you, know you got, Vada? You know what we doing. I will be going with Shayna Ashley. Okay. Preparation. Hey. Preparation yes. creates separation. Yes. You can't right. be battling last week, yep. commentary, and now you're battling now. All his, right, his battle with Mike P is so new that they haven't finished rapping yet. He and didn't. now he's on stage battling but her. That's you, a big you difference. See it? We want our drinks brought to us on camera. Hashtag Chrome 23. Tonight we do what we want. I That's see Shane fact. Ashley on stage. Rosenberg Raw is on stage. Oh, yeah. Looks like they're starting to get mic'd up. Oh, so he, so we he's should got his be Philly ready. gear on. He's okay. got his Philly gear on. It ain't authentic, on. but he got it on, though. Huh. I like that. She said he got a poppy shop joint like on, that? but. I like the attire that Fro's got on. You know, the okay. Eagles gear. It I works. Like it. You know what I'm saying? She about to knock when the Eagles not, right off his shirt. I mean, it's I all like right. It. It's cool. Shayna look ready. She got her glasses on. Oh, man, I'm excited for this energy. I really feel like, like they're about to bring the energy. Y'all might. Hey, Shayna, I, Shayna, I love it. Shayna has on lime green pants. Now, as someone who wore leather pants on the last stream, she's very brave <laughs> today. So that's why I have her winning. Because you got to have some heart to come outside in lime green pants. And trust me, I got her winning. I went from 2-1 two, two, to 3-0 now. Listen, I love the look. Shayna looks great. I love the look. She's Definitely ready. Her giving. makeup is on point. Her hair is on point. And you do have to have confidence to wear lime green pants. And she is rocking those pants. It is giving boss. It is giving. Uh, and she's the stage ready. is definitely given intergender. We got the ladies behind her yes. repping hard. Oh, the team heavy. Chrome team 23, heavy I do what I want. Chrome yes. 23, I do what I want. Hashtag Chrome 23. Yes. I'm excited. I'm too. Until until they cut the stream, I just want to say salute to y'all. And y'all still got a little bit of time to tell your friend to tell a friend to cop this pay-per-view. The price right. still went up. Yes, right. But you might want to cop it down before the main event. I'm just saying, it's going to go up you again. Might. You might. You might. You know what I'm saying? It's packed yes. in here. Ooh, we can it's, hear her. I I'm feel starting the to sweat. energy. This build, I think hot. this building yeah. is about to explode. This might be battle of the night. That's yeah, we need we need a battle after. I mean, you know, like I said earlier, we had a couple audio issues. You know what I'm saying? Got through the battle, but this is the type of the stuff that we're here for. We want to see smoke. Streets need a body. I feel they like do. it's gonna be a it's gonna be a few room shakers in this I, one. I though. think so. I feel I it coming. I feel it coming. I don't I don't know why, but I feel like this battle. Even though it might be battle tonight, I feel like we might get a landslide from one of them. So Somebody saying, might get it's tore a debate. up. It could be a smoke break. Somebody or might get tore up in here. It could this be. Battle. Somebody battle like it's six days ago. It's yeah. definitely going to be a good one. Uh, I can, I'm yeah. so excited. I don't even know what to do. Yes, yes. As you can see, Remy, trying to hold it down. Yes. We making sure that all of the audio is going to get set So they're up, currently so no getting issues. the mics together, making sure the audio issues is, is, is prepared and That's straight correct. so this next battle mm -hmm. could go smoothly. So at this point, we're just sitting here waiting yeah. for patience. You know what yes. I'm saying? Yeah, we, we asking for everybody to be patient and salute to Chrome 23. I do what I want. Why y'all Why y'all doing that? Make sure y'all getting them tweets out there, man. That's a fact. How y'all feeling? Tweeting. Tweet who y'all got winning. We would love to see it. On on, on X or is it or is it Twitter? I, Twitter X. It looks. It's, it's X. It's or just X. a black box with an it X. It looked like porn on my phone. It just looked like a porn app on my phone. Like I, I got Instagram. I got went to the wrong Facebook. Went, that was the wrong app. Wrong oh my bad. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna click it again because <laughs> when it pop up, it do. Be some, it's never just mind. the X. Not okay, the X. 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 When oh. it pops up, it pops up. Okay. 
All right, so we get into the All battle. Right. Yeah. Shout out to Chrome 23. Shout out to Ferry and Shuni, my brother Showtime SP. Yes. Let's get to it. Let's talk about how we got here. Nigga said, you funky. I said, no, that is not clear. I met her at an RBE event. She smelled marvelous. That's when it got weird. Because I could tell by her arm fat, her potato salad is top <laughs> I see the big picture, but don't you be trying to hook me up with the little sister that's bigger than the bitch. I said shout out to your promo, Frozy. But those snack jokes was a little typical. Now I ain't mad. Shit, I even laughed. I'm just saying, it's hypocritical. But I get it, boo. When you selling the fight, shit like that do be pivotal. But somebody should have told Craig, this big bitch get physical. <laughs> it's lit for you. I told my niggas, oh yeah, he's dead. Mm. Just go wait and see. Introduce him out the gate. Oh, he don't know Baby D. Ain't yo silly. Ain't yo silly. He don't know Baby D. Ain't yo silly. Let's switch this shit. I done been through blocks and boom box. Young boy, I robbed a nigga with a remote in a tube sock. I, I ain't. White sheets. Wrap them and dump them where they can't track good. But don't worry, I zigzag the trail out of those backwoods. I'm that good. It's a meal worth. I zigzag those trails out of those backwoods. I'm that good. It's a meal worth the game. Shout out to Gilly. But if I split them down the middle, did I go Dutch or go Philly? Hey, yo, play. Good. She got the fan, it's 1-1. One, one. Hey, yo, it's 1-1. One, one. She, one, one, one. she got the fan. <laughs> she give out dick sucks the long way. I said, damn, niggas be hitting Shayna? He said, no, nah, all jaw play. She a duck, so it be tougher niggas to hit you. You like a Paul Lay. WNBA, NBA, yeah, we all ballers, but it's a reason in the WNBA they make the ball small. It was hot, Shane. It, it was hot, Farrah. It was hot, Farrah. It was hot. I said you not raw, because if you was, we wouldn't stomach you. Impossible meat. As long as the season right, we gon' fuck with you. It's nothing new. Yeah, the fans been told him he was so-so. Left for rare breed, but couldn't be breed. That's a no-no. Shikari, I be running a hundred, and he is slow-mo. And for the record, this bitch still hold it. Shout out to Flojo. I'm back dumping. You just stood in front of Shane. You just stood in front of Shane to ask me. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. She said last night at the face-off. Who's gonna feel different standing in front of her? Yeah. Was it different? No, not at all. I think Shane is a dog. She Hold it down! I knew that when we go up the lead into the battle, all that shit talk don't really mean nothing. Shane didn't know I love her. She wanted the top girls in the game, one of the top battles in the game. You feel like you won the battle. Absolutely, 2 1 4. <laughs> Shane, I hate What you said? You can talk, you can talk, your mic is on. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, How you feel about that? Um, well, for one, let me just say shout out to Froze for taking this battle. You know what I'm saying? He's one of the, the first top dudes that I've um, taken. I'm glad I got to do it for Chrome and for Philly. Thank but that was, <laughs> that was a 3-0. That was a 3-0. Shout out to y'all. Right. We're going to pass it back up there 
to the commentary section, Shuni and Bada is talking. You know, in life, we go up, we go down, we win, we lose, we rise, we fall. Sometimes you may get the things that you want, but you might not want what you get. That's real shit. Let me talk to you about some things. Just go. My first life just happens to be my same life I ball shot and cooked up work all in the same nights Ain't that a triple threat, I dumped down my intellect No bullets from a shotgun pass, I dare them intercept A nigga never brung sand to the beach But I did breakdowns for every single gram in a key I put them pounds in a Ford, then left in a Beamer And shipped the work out to Phoenix like Trevor Ariza Shit, I came from the block when a murder was robbing A nigga don't like me, that's a personal problem It's been a year since I wrote a rhyme Shit, I've been all around the world getting my passport notarized I tip the whip so niggas will never know the ride I give my young in a head nod, that nigga know the ride And with the bars, I'm a top three spitter Just need one arm in a game like Shot Queen Griffin Respect me is what you ought to do I'm the oracle, when I walk away they still feel my vibe cause my aura cool First life, I was focused on these bitches. My second life, yeah, I was focused on these riches. My third life, yeah, I really spent poor. So my fourth life's only right that I teach you more. It be that real shit they try to ignore. I'm more worry about what the water gon' look like at the shore. It be the first quarter and they worry about the score. Don't realize by the fourth quarter that it's yours. Try to tell you before, stick to the schedule. And if you live in life to the foolish, just never settle. They more worry about the rocks in they vessel. Me, I'm more worry about dodging the devil. Dodging the metal like I'm Logan. Leg drops from the side ropes, all coking. From the last shot, yeah, my gun's still smoking. Been around more green in the US Open. I'm not joking.